the real estate market has to be slowing down, right? Well, somebody forgot to tell the home buyers. The latest sales data is in, and I can promise you don't want to miss my market update for April of 2022. Hi, this is Eva Lin. You might be surprised to find out, but we're coming off yet another record-breaking month for local home values. Let's take a quick look at some of the numbers. The median price per square foot in Pasadena exceeded $850 last month. This number has never been higher. And houses are selling faster than they ever have. It's taking just 10 days at the median for Pasadena home sellers to open escrow with a buyer. To put things into context, up until about 18 months ago, it would generally take around 30 days for a house to sell. In South Pasadena, we see similar dynamics. March brought all-time record high prices in terms of cost per square foot at nearly $1,050. And it just took 12 days for houses to sell in median terms. Not to be outdone, La Caneta house values also hit a record high, coming in at $970 per square foot and selling at a blazing fast 10 days. Lastly, in San Marino, the price per square foot did not hit a record high last month, but it was the second highest on record for the city at well over $1,000. While this information is certainly interesting, it's really not that helpful in guiding your decisions. That's because we're talking about what's already happened. Most people I speak with are hoping to learn more about what's likely to happen. Even though I can't predict the future, I can share some other numbers with you that point us in the right direction. Let's take a look at new listings and active listings, and I'll show why these stats are important. In Pasadena, the average number of houses for sale at any given time during March was about 100. 12 months prior, in March of 2021, that number was nearly 50% higher at about 150. And last month, there were around 80 houses listed for sale in Pasadena. But during the same month, one year ago, there were over 100 houses listed for sale. I could rattle off similar stats for South Pasadena, La Cañada, and San Marino. But the point is this. There simply aren't enough houses going up for sale to meet buyer demand. And based on this data, it doesn't look like that's going to change anytime soon. Even as interest rates rise and the home buyer pool shrinks, there still won't be enough houses for those buyers who do stay in the market. So prices aren't likely to drop. Just today, I was listening to a quick podcast from Peter Maluk, one of the country's most credible investment advisors, as he talked about this very issue. I've included a link in case you'd like to check it out yourself. At the end of the day, my advice to clients is this. The best time to sell or buy a house is different for everybody. The best time is when you're ready, financially and emotionally. Whenever that time comes, you can be sure that I'll be ready to provide the level of care and the exceptional results you deserve. If there's anything I can do to support you with selling or buying a home this year, please don't hesitate to reach out. You can call me at 626-807-6581 or find me at lanerealtygroup.com. Thank you so much.